Chris, were you trying to chime in there? Chris Lagueros has been in Chopper 7 for several hours now covering this, uh, the, all the May Day happenings. Well, we saw this group grow right past Nike Town at 6th and Pine. There was a skirmish of some kind. Our assignment desk said that it might have been between one of the protesters and somebody who was uh, outside the crowd, possibly one of those guys that uh, patrols in the superhero outfits. We haven't been able to confirm that yet, but there was some kind of a skirmish where the police moved in, and then quickly the crowd dissipated. Now, they have moved down pine and it looks like they're making a right turn it looks like that could possibly be fourth avenue again so now they would be moving in a direction again towards west lake we'll see whether or not uh, uh they're going to stop there or keep going but at this point all right chris we'll check back in with you in just a minute let's go to henry rossoff henry what's please happening stay away from me please stay away from me so we're talking to a gentleman here who says he was pushing a little skirmish broke out and police kind of broke everything sir take me to the top what happened Oh, well, this woman right here is a very violent instigator. She ended up tripping this man with a cane. So I came in and said, be careful where you're going. And then she pushed, and then her friend started shooting some kind of aerosol. I came over to take it out of his hand, and then all these punches started coming in. Are you with the Phoenix Jones crew? I see your, your outfit here. I worked with him for a little time. And Phoenix Jones uh, talking about the man who is kind of taken on a vigilante role in our community, uh, coming to the rescue of, of people who have had problems. These are more images from Chopper 7 up above, but that was just Henry Rossoff giving us a picture of what things have been like on, a gr on the ground. A little bit tense in some situations. And now the group again moving into Westlake Plaza. David Hanson.